branch.io tutorial how to use branch.io for beginners step by step hey guys welcome back in this video i'm giving you a tutorial on branch.io how to make all channels lead to you so let's get into it first of all you're gonna go to branch.io and you will land on this website right here branch.io allows flawless mobile linking and attribution in order to get started you can actually create an account with your google account or using your email address you can create an account for free after the initial sign up or sign in to your branch.io this is where you will land now this is your main dashboard that we get so at this side of your dashboard, you'll be able to find the option, which is channels and links. This is where you see ads, journeys, emails, and quick links. Then we have our cross channel analytics, where we have our sources. We have exports, in exports, we have data feeds, daily exports, custom exports. Then we have configure. I'll go through all of these options one by one. So first of all, we have a summary. This is going to be the main summary of your dashboard where you'll be able to see all of your data such as the clicks, the installs, opens and more. We also have quick link option here again clicks and installs, uh, universal ads, journeys and more. Then we have channels and links. This is where we work most of the time. So the first option is ads. We will click on ads and it will take us to the overview of the ads here. Now in ads, you'll be able to see all of the different, uh, you know, ads, organic traffic that you're getting, inorganic traffic, all of the different channels that you're running. You can actually, you will be able to get all of the overviews and analytics for that. To create links with branch IO, you have to go to the links option here. You can see within our channels and links, we have quick link option. This is where you create a link uh, for your ad and for your different channels. So we can either go with the quick link option or we can just simply go to uh, create a link for the ad. So here we have links option within our ads. Click on create ad link. Now, app only, app install or engagement, create display link or create search link. We can create different types of ad links within branch IO. So if you have an app that you want to get installed, then you will create such link. But I'm just going to simply go with create display link. Select your type and click on continue. Now we have to give our link a name. Uh, you can add any name here, any, you know, if you have any product, if you have any website, if you have any app, you can just simply go with the name here. So for now, I'm going to call it test. Then we have which ad partner is this for? Now you can select your ad partner from here. So I'm just going to simply go with this one. Okay, now we will click on save and enable. And your ad partner will be enabled from here. Click on save. So now that your ad partner is saved, we can move on to the next step, which is creating the link. What ad format are you looking for? So this is where you'll select a cross-platform display or any other display you want to. Then you can click on create link now or you can go to the configure options. In configure options, you will have uh, your code here. Where should the user be taken within your app? So you will enter your key here. This is going to be your key from your app if you have an app. Then you will enter the value here. If you want to add more data, you want to add another key, you can just click on add data and it will give you more options or you can get rid of um, the option from here. So you can see more data and it will allow me to add more than one keys. So I'm going to go with just one. So these are all of the configure options that you can go to. Then we also have validate and share. Now this is where your ad link will be created. Once you're done with the define and configure options, the third option is validate and share. Now this is where your link will be created. So that's actually really easy. Uh, what I've done, you just follow all of the steps and you'll be able to create an ad link in no time. So here we have our ad link. Click tracking ad link and impression tracking link. So we have two links that we created. All you have to do is now copy and it's copied to the clipboard so one more thing that i like to do with these links is you can use platforms such as bitly to just shorten the link if you want to add it to your any for instance your youtube channel or any other website then you can shorten the link as well but this is the link that you will be getting once the link is created 
once it's added to the website we can go to the analytics now in analytics i will be getting all of the overviews the organic traffics and i will be able to check with different filters we have event level and um, different options available here then we also have the partner management so this is where we add different partners add partners here so it's actually really easy to add a partner as i showed you go to the partner option click on create quick link add link or journey we can also create a journey with branch io but for this one you will actually have to sign up to a you have to update your plan i'll show you the present plan in a minute so journeys are not available in their free plan then we also have the email option available within our branch io so with email we can actually create our emails with the links we can also integrate different email platforms crm platforms to our uh, branch io to get our email marketing campaigns across our different platforms moving on we have sources now this is also another important option that we get on our branch io which is the cross channel analytics so if you want to compare different channels and if you want to compare different ads then you go to this option and here what we can do is we can actually compare uh different uh, you know channels and we have like cross channel analytics here so this is the option and you'll be able to add filters to you can uh, compare different campaigns we have organic traffic here we have click to options given and all of the different uh, you know uh, time settings that we can do then we also have exports now in exports we have data feeds daily exports and custom exports now it depends on you if you want to export your data your feeds daily then you can set up this option and we can also go with the custom option that is given integrations are also available within our branch io to integrate different email marketing platforms and more uh, we also have the quick link option so it's different from the link option go to quick links here and click on create and quick link now quick link has all of these options and within just you know few steps you have your link ready link title for this one again i'm just going to go with the word test link domain uh, then we have original click on save and continue analytics tags so some will be added already but you can select your options save and continue redirect add your redirections if you have um, ios android or desktop it depends on your app or a website that you have especially the app click on save and continue link data um, again this is where you will add the key and value so this is like a quick way to create a link you can see we are getting all of the options here click on save and continue after adding the keys and then the last option is the social media tags where you add the title you add the description image urls click on create link and your link is created within few minutes you just have to enter all of the details so this is the quick link option available on branch io there's also the test version of branch io so you can switch to the live and the test from here at the top this is where you add your app and if you want to click right here create new app give your app a name uh, so this is going to take like you know some time for instance test click on create and your new app will be created and then you will be able to create more campaigns for this app and you will be able to then create links you will be able to then create um you know emails and much more the things that we just did so we can do all of this by creating an app uh, with branch io and you can manage all of the analytics and data for that app that you created when it comes to the pricing plan for branch io there is a zero dollars per month so this is the self-serve option this one is best in class mobile linking plus ads and all in one platform then we also have a custom pricing so this one is going to be custom pricing for custom features so you can also go with this one so this is the pricing plan for branch io the platform is very easy to use allows you to create your own app once the app is created you can do a lot with it and it gives you the access to create attributions and links for your app this brings us to the end of the video i hope that i was a big help don't forget to give it a big thumbs up leave a comment down below turn on bell notification and subscribe to youtube channel